The turncoat Aussie cyclist who defected to Great Britain has revealed his new team colors and received a battering in the comments section for his trouble. Matt Richardson turned from Aussie hero to public enemy number one by announcing he would be racing for Great Britain from now on. Richardson represented Australia until August this year, competing as a track cyclist in the men's Kieran individual sprint and team sprint at the 2020 Tokyo Olympics, where the Australians finished fourth. At the 2024 Paris Olympics, the Kent-born 25-year-old secured two silver medals in the men's Kieran and sprint and a bronze in the men's team sprint. He then shocked Australians by announcing his decision to switch nationalities and compete for Great Britain, citing personal reasons and a desire to chase new dreams. This move was approved by the Union Cyclist International, UCI, and following his defection, Richardson competed for Great Britain in the UCI Track Champions League three days ago, winning the men's sprint and Kieran finals in France. AUS Cycling has banned Richardson for life from representing Australia, citing his conduct before defecting, including withholding information about his switch and requesting to take AUS Cycling property to Great Britain. The ban prohibits him from rejoining the Australian cycling team, accessing its resources, or receiving related awards. In the wake of the ban, Richardson has taken to social media to show off his new national colors along with his new team strip, earning the ire of Aussie sport fans in the process. Richardson said the design of his new uniform was really cool. Red, white, blue, super clean. Matches the legs as well. It's cool to finally be in it. After watching riders for the last three years race in it, it's a bit of a weird feeling. But it's cool and definitely a 10 out of 10 for me. He also posted to his personal Instagram account after his first race for Great Britain in France. Dream start to the at Usical in Paris. Tough night out there with what felt like a lot of pressure to perform. Long way to go still, so just taking it one race at a time. Next stop, Netherlands, he said. While British fans were stoked to see their new superstar parading his new colors on social media, Aussies were less enthused. Richardson will next compete in round three of the UCI Track Champions League on November 30th, where Appledorn in the Netherlands will make its debut as a venue on the tour.